Hi, welcome to Cat Theory 5 video tutorial. This time I want to show you how you could use images in Cat Theory 5 with the apply sticker command, which is available in the Photo Studio. Therefore, I used surfaces and then applied the sticker to the surfaces. So, let's have fun with Cat Theory 5. I have already prepared the surfaces for this exercise. They have the desired dimensions. Yeah. Just simple extrudes. Four of them. One, two, three, four. And now I want to apply the sticker, which will be the picture or the images of the cars. And this command is available, this one, in the photo studio. But you could customize one of your toolbars and add that command to one of your st standard toolbars. Okay, so let's go for apply sticker. Select a face, maybe this one, and then you have to go for your picture. I will take uh, this one, that one, and then you have to adjust it, and that's a little bit tedious. So I could add a size here, let's say one zero zero two column five. And this usually happens so this scale will relate to that size click right here and it should be scaled yes you could flip the picture vertical and horizontal and then you can adjust here by the position and the scaling you could drag here and here but it's easier to do it with this one so go for a position right in the middle and you might change this to 1000 at least and it always adds <laughs> one number somehow crazy and yeah maybe like this and now adjust move it down with those chalk dials Move it in the center, and then it's easier to scale. So this should be scaled, maybe and this should be scaled a little bit. Then adjust the position. I think you get the idea. Confirm. And then for the next one, apply a sticker this would be the side view not this one but uh, this one flip it and you could adjust it maybe like this and then adjust this position I would really prefer the sketch tracer because I think that's even more annoying. So that one.
And a little bit scaling is necessary. Too much. Yeah, maybe like this. Confirm. Yeah. You have to fine tune, of course. So the next one will be right here. Apply sticker. That's the top view. Mm, this one. This has to be flipped. One, two, of course, in both directions. Then move it. the center maybe like this yeah then in that direction then scale it right now it's scaled the ratio will be kept, but you could break this link, then you could adjust the scaling V and U direction independent. But I will go for dependent. And yeah, like this. Then scale it once more. Seems I have to break it if I want to scale it to that face. Maybe like this. Okay, and the last picture. Now, oh, see, that's not correct. So, didn't notice. You should go for the top view. This would be this one. Yeah. And then it's better to see. So that should be. Yeah, maybe like this. Okay. And the last one. No, that's still no good, this one, that sticker. That's the wrong view, I want to have the side view, this one. And I break this because it's easier. So move this down a little bit. Scale it a little bit more like this. Okay. Last one on this surface. Apply another sticker. Go for the back view. Open it. Select it once more. And you could delete this and it should be around 1000 you have to flip it both ways drag it a little bit maybe like this and then move it Let's take a look from this side. Yeah, that's quite good. And that is 
position yeah we have to scale it a little bit down too much move it scale it a little bit it's too much and you could break that link and scale it in that direction this looks good okay and I'm done so I think the sketch tracer is the more likely method I would use but you could do it with these surfaces as well hope you enjoyed this one if you liked it please give it a like or leave a comment if you want to see more please give it a like or leave a comment Please subscribe to my YouTube channel, please subscribe to my Facebook cat fan page and give it a like over there, it would be very nice of you. Thanks for watching, see you to the next one, bye bye.